And just like that, guys, my daughter found me a scooter. Okay, guys, we are gonna walk to our scooter. It's not the greatest, but we're gonna make it do what it do. What is up, y'all? It's me, Tiktosh, and welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to my channel. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe on the video because why wouldn't you? You guys, today we are going to two stores. This is our first store, and guess what, guys? This is gonna be a two-store video, so you will see both stores in this video. All right, guys, let's get ready to shop till we drop. We're having tacos tonight, so I've already called my husband to find out what ingredients we do have and what ingredients we don't. And you guys, I think our scooter might be dying, but we're going to find out in just a minute. I am a little bit heavy for the scooter. This is one of the smaller ones, and sometimes when we're going up the hill, it can't carry this big caboose, but I think it's picking the speed back up now. It did, guys. So yeah, we're gonna go get some taco ingredients and I don't know what else, let's see. This is not the scooter that displays how much battery is left, but let's go, guys. tomatoes and onions and we are going over here look at all the beautiful balloons and flowers i meant to check and see did my children eat any of those cherries i bought because i know that i did not eat any yet yeah so we're gonna start over here guys I don't think anyone eats tomatoes. Do y'all eat tomatoes on y'all taco? Okay, she says she does at her house, but not at mine, so cool. Let's see what we're going to grab. We need shredded lettuce, that's for sure. Let's go. I think it's up this way. Okay. Shredded iceberg. Wow. Okay, guys, so here it's 278 and at Kroger it isn't. So I think I'm gonna pick that up at the local Kroger. That one is $1.98. So let's go back here, guys. Yes, I'm comparing prices because we need to be budgeting as much as we can. Those beautiful pineapples. That lemonade was really good last time, guys. I'm gonna grab me one. Let's see. Yeah, so we're gonna go ahead and get one of those. Got our rotisseries, there's, ooh, look at those muffins. supposed to really be getting these but I am and I'm not going to a different angle so 
although I don't like that their shelves are very, very bare, I still went ahead and grabbed them. Let's see what else. Oh, the butter mints. I absolutely love butter mints. I might grab some of these. Nah, I don't want to get those because the peppermints that I normally get, guys, let me see if they have that bag. I don't see them. It's not that one there, but I mean, it could be, but it was a different one that I normally get. Candy corn they have. Um, nope, I only see those peppermint. So yeah, let's turn around and look. All right, y'all, last time I turned around, I was able to find them right here in the other location, but I don't see them in this location. And wow, I really wanted those peppermint. Maybe I'll try this brand up here. Let's see, do I wanna try the buttermint? Or, no, I'm gonna try the buttermint this time, guys. We're gonna go ahead and try these out. If you like a great mint, like a restaurant mint, then butter mint is what you're gonna be looking for. So we're gonna go ahead and try that out. Okay, guys. Yeah, we're definitely gonna have to go to the other store because I don't know, maybe their meat counter is not working or something, but this is not looking good for me. I won't be utilizing this particular location. It's a little scary looking here with all the meat being gone. So don't tell me that we came to this English location just to grab that. There's those cute little salamis I got last time. Okay, these are pepperoni kind. I didn't even know they had the pepperonis. The last time I got the salami one. Where is it? Let's see. No, those are pepperoni also, but yeah, I'm not gonna grab any. So I was gonna, there she is. She caught back up with me. So I was gonna look at the ground beef. Did you notice how their meat is looking? And like everything is out of stock. Let me show you guys this. Even with the milk and stuff, like I'm not even feeling led to get anything from this location. It is really, really, really scary in here, guys. I don't know what's going on. Oh yeah, something is going on here. Like the day I decided to come to this location, look what happened. <laughs> but anyway, you guys, we are in here on our two-store run. I'm gonna chance the candy, but something tells me that I should put that back too, but I'm not. You guys, comment down below if you've ever had the sweet tarts. Comment down below. Okay guys, so the manager told me that they are, they did have a problem with their freezers. They threw everything out. So it's safe to say we're not gonna be getting anything like that. Oh, paper towel. Let's see if their paper towel is on sale. So I'm completely out of paper towel. I wanna go to Dollar Tree. All right. Okay guys, my daughter just opted in to pushing me in Dollar Tree. So we're going to Dollar Tree. But you'll have to wait until the next video to see that. <laughs> All right guys, we're headed to the register with our three items. Because yeah, the store is having a little technical difficulty. So it's gonna be safe to say we need to exit this store. So let's get on up to the register. And I forgot my little key fob thingy. So I have to enter my phone number or use my daughter's. Oh, they don't have one. Oh, they do have a self check down there. All right. Hey guys, we're going over to self check. Cute 
Doritos minis. And the cheese balls. This is all that we have, guys. It's these three items. There's one available up there. And we are gonna make our way down here. You can buy a bag or a damaged right now. If you do not have a car, please scan the first item and place it in the bag. This one doesn't want to open for us. Excuse me. Please scan your ankles at damage card now. If you do not have a card, please scan the first item and place it in the bag. Yay, we got our Ingles number in. Please place the item in the bag area. You have to leave it in the bag area. It is. Oh. Hey guys, we are getting out of here. Mm -hmm. Okay guys, just like that, we are out of here. And although I wasn't 100% satisfied with this store trip because of the freezer and everything being out, it's okay. I did find some of my good items, so. Okay guys, and just like that, there's not enough scooters in the store, so someone's gonna follow me out and borrow this one. And just like that, guys, just like that, guys, my daughter found me a scooter. Now, she did have to wait for one, and but it's okay, we got one. That's all that matters. As you can see, that green sign back there, we're in Publix, and we are gonna go get the taco stuff and something sweet one of our fellow disabled people fell off the curb guys but we are headed in let's go see what we can find let's go shopping all right guys we're going in let's see what we can find Ooh. okay guys I'm about to get this for my husband. Father's Day is Sunday, but we're going to trick him. And it is about fishing. We're going to have his Father's Day tonight while everyone is at the house. Because my daughter is spending the night. And that cake is $12.99. Okay, guys, we are going to go down here. I'm going to grab a cup of ice from the bakery deli. Buy one, get one. They're eight forty nine. I don't think they have the ice in this. Yes, they do. Yeah, I have enough. What did we do for I have enough. All right. I wish we would have brought my Mielke. I'm just going to get a cup. All right, guys. My daughter's going to fill up her Mielke, and I am going to go back and get me a cup of ice. But I do need shredded iceberg lettuce from over here. And I think it's down that way. So let's go grab the ice first. Hey guys, the ice and water is complimentary. You don't have to pay for it here at Publix. They only have the small cups right now, which is fine because I'm just gonna put that into my Miyoki when I get back in the car. But FYI, if you have a Miyoki, bring it in with you 
My daughter always asks me, do I want my Miyoki? And I told her no this time. So yeah, it's right there in the cart. I don't need to, um, what you call it. To eat organic, they have all of their organic chips and everything there, and multi-grain crackers, avocado, all of that. Um, I'm going to get the taco stuff. Shredded lettuce over here. Hey guys, an item is up high, so my daughter is going to get it for us. And we are getting the shredded iceberg, and it is two something here when it's a dollar. You know, that's not this bag, is it? Oh wow, it's four dollars here, and I can get this over at Walmart for a dollar and 98 cent, guys. Okay, guys, we're gonna need the nacho chip and all of that, and we are going to need the ground beef. So let's just look on the aisles and see where the chips are located. Or maybe we'll get to the ground beef first. I was gonna go to Publix, guys. I mean to Kroger, but I thought about how packed they're gonna be. So that's how we end up at Publix instead. I didn't wanna go down to Walmart today. So yeah. All right, guys. We got these are $16.48. Grab one of those, and then I'm gonna grab one more. Let's scoot up. And you're gonna pay a little bit more, a lot more, because you're in public. So here's one for eight dollars and twenty-nine cents, guys. So we'll go ahead and grab that one. And we eat a lot of taco stuff, so. Yeah, now let's go find the chips. And then cheese, we're gonna need. We're celebrating Father's Day tonight. I can't believe this. But it was a great idea by my daughter. Chips are done. I'm gonna grab the cheese first, and then come back up. We got the taco shell. We need cheese and sour cream. You guys, I love how Publix is always fully stocked and everything looks so nice and neat. That's what I really, really, really love. I need some of those drumstick ice creams, but am I supposed to have them? No, I'm not. So we're not gonna do it. We're not gonna do it. We're not gonna do it. We are not going to do it. Did we pass up sour cream? All right, guys, we gotta grab some Kraft Mexican cheese. Let's see. It's up high. The cheese is up pretty high here, guys. So I gotta wait on my daughter. But this is what our cart is looking like. Nothing too major, but the prices are really, really steep. That is almost 20, that's like $26 right there for the meat or more, a little bit more. This is, it turned out to be two something, not $3.79. Then the cake is $2.99. This Daisy sour cream, my daughter said, is $1.79. All right, then we need the Mexican up there. Yep, Mexican four cheese. And we got the craft Mexican four cheese. Now we gotta go grab some chips. It's pretty packed in here today, guys. Oh, we should have some ice cream balls. Nobody's gonna want nobody's gonna wanna make them, so. Is it this one? Yep. 
All right, guys, we are looking for Tostitos, and they are right there. Okay, the traditional yellow corn, I think we're gonna do. And there are no prices on any of this. They are $5.99, guys. And so, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and get that bag. And one more bag, which is 12 bucks for two bags of chips. But this is the brand, the only brand that I like. Okay, guys, we're gonna get one more of these just to make sure that we have enough. Where? Which way? Okay. All right, guys, we're gonna do the self check. But we gotta figure out where the line is. She's finished over here. Alright guys, I'm gonna do this. I just said I was gonna do this one up here. Alright guys, let's go ahead and get started. Just like that, guys, what a way to spend $67 within less than 30 minutes. So, yeah, that was our Publix haul. If y'all like this video, throw the thumbs up, turn on your post notifications, and make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, guys. $67.25. Y'all, I could have got all this at Walmart, literally for 50, but it is what it is. 